What's up guys? Today I'm checking out the brand new Echo Show 15 and we're also going to be checking out this tilt stand for the Echo Show 15. But first of all, let's see what we get inside the main box. First thing you see is the Echo Show, so if we just lift this out of the box, wow, that's, uh, wow, that is huge. Let me just place that to the side. So this is everything you get in the box. We've got a quick start guide and here is the mounting bracket itself. So if you want to mount this to the wall, you're going to be using this bracket and the screws are also included. A 30 watt power supply. And last but not least, the Echo Show 15 itself. So first impressions, it's absolutely massive in size. It weighs a good 2.2 kgs and in thickness, it's 35 millimeters. So yes, it is quite large and thick and it's got some weight to it. Now, first of all, I want to show you how the mounting bracket works. So if you fix this bracket onto the wall, exactly like this, so that side onto the wall, you can see that arrow facing upwards. Then all you're going to do is drop this unit on and you can take it off when you want. So for example, if you imagine that's been dropped into the unit, that will now hold the unit on the wall. And if you want to lift it off, you simply pushing the unit upwards and the unit comes off. So that's how the bracket works, nice and easy. So quick look at the ports on the top. So you've got volume control, you've got a mic and camera on and off switch, and you've got a camera privacy cover. So you can see what happens there. That's the camera. Now you see me, now you don't. So that's a five megapixel camera, privacy cover, and you've got two microphones on the side. On this side, you have nothing. At the bottom, you've got nothing and nothing on the other side. So to describe this, it looks like a tablet slash photo frame, um, something in between. It's kind of like combining a 15.6 inch Amazon Fire tablet with an Echo speaker and giving it a photo frame look. So yeah, I'm actually digging that design. And as you can see, the setup process is quite simple. Just connect to your Wi-Fi network and follow the on-screen instructions. Now the Echo Show 15 is made completely from plastic. The bezels um, going all the way around the border, everything is plastic. Then you have another inner white bezel and then your 15.6 inch display. So this is a full HD display that's 1920 by 1080 and it is a full touch screen, very responsive. Um, so it can be used like a tablet. Uh, but one thing to bear in mind, there is no internal storage. So you can't actually download apps and use it as a tablet as such. But what the Echo Show is actually for is to stream online content. So whether you're checking the weather, searching a recipe, or watching a movie on Netflix or Amazon Prime Video, this product no doubt gives you a great experience. Now the speaker volume is very loud. I was actually surprised to how loud this thing is um, and it's very clear. Audio quality is superb. If you're using the most recent Echo Dot speaker to compare it, this is like having four of those speakers in one. It's that powerful. Now that camera at the top is a five megapixel camera and every time you open or close the privacy cover, it tells you camera on and camera off. Um, when you press the volume control, you can see I've got it just under halfway because it's very loud, um, but you can keep it pressed. You can turn it up and down and you can even use the touch screen for volume. But to be on the safe side, you want it about there because like I said, it's very loud. You've got full Alexa voice control features. You can still control all your smart home devices as you would on a regular Echo speaker. You can view your live cameras that you have linked to Alexa and control your ring alarm and any other hardware or device that you're using with your current Alexa speakers, you're gonna be able to use with this. So all the usual smart speaker stuff like checking the weather, getting directions, searching for recipes and asking Alexa for a joke or even asking for your favorite song. You can do all of that on this device. The Echo Show 15 also lets you watch your favorite videos and movies online via Netflix, YouTube, Amazon Prime Video and lots more. And the beauty of it is no remote required. You can use your voice to control everything. For example, asking Alexa to play your favorite movie um, you can also control everything with your fingertips via the touchscreen. So best of both worlds. Now this does support OTA updates and as soon as I switched it on, a firmware update was available and you can see it's downloading it right now. 
Another great thing about this device is it can be used portrait or landscape. So you're not bound by any one orientation. You can use it either way. I want to quickly check out the tilt stand we've got for this. So I have attached the stand. You just got two screws that you need to tighten. Um, and then you've got the stand basically on a hinge, as you can see. And on the back, you do have a cord wrap. So if the cord is too long, you can wrap it up. But I'm good, so I'm just going to attach the lid back. So check it out, guys. Really like the stand. So you can push the Echo Show forward and backwards to achieve an angle. Um, and the surface material over here is soft. So it's not going to scratch up your Echo Show. It's a really nice big display. It shows you all the music that you have been recently playing. You can actually have a slideshow of your own personal photos if you want. So a lot of customization options are there for you. You can see the recently played music. You can see your recent Kindle books, um, shopping list. Um, this is not my shopping list. This is just an example. But if you tap it, you can go ahead and add things and remove things. So you can add cheese, milk, eggs, and you can see how quick that is. And if you didn't want to type or touch, you can say, Alexa, add bread to my shopping list. Bread added to your shopping list. See that? See how convenient that was. Uh, Alexa home. The shopping list is always there. We've got your smart home favorites on that corner. So Alexa, show me my front door. And there you can see my front door camera working absolutely fine on demand. That's really cool how it miniaturized in the corner and it's still open. So if we just swipe down, you can see a whole bunch of settings. So home settings, do not disturb, alarms, brightness, notifications, and widget gallery. Then you've got discovery, communicate music, smart home, video, routines, and photo frame. I wanna quickly show you the widget gallery. So you've got a whole bunch of widgets that you can immediately add to your home, home screen. So you know we've already got the shopping list, weather to do, sticky notes. Sticky notes is quite good. Let's add that widget to the home screen. And that's done. If we go back, let's add what to eat. Always useful. You notice I just pressed the plus. Quick and easy way of doing it. We've got music and audio, big and small. So I'm gonna add the bigger version to see if that's any good. Um, yeah, that's it. Let's go back. So there's the Alexa homepage, recently played what to eat there's a sticky notes and i do want to try the sticky notes the music is still there shopping list um, so everything gets a bit more compacted but still easy to use so we can add text here we can tell alexa to type for us alexa new sticky note okay what should the sticky note say don't forget to pick up the movie hey okay, i've saved your sticky note now once you have selected all your favorite widgets you can navigate them by swiping left and right, but you can also rearrange them at any point. So if you tap on rearrange windows, you can now very easily just tap and move stuff around as required. If there's something you want to get rid of, just tap the cross and it will be gone. And once you're done, hit the done button and that's it. So you're getting a very nice responsive 15.6 inch full HD display and it's a pleasure to work with. Let's try some music. Alexa, play some Drake. Here's some music by Drake on Amazon Music. You even got lyrics. Alexa, skip track. Nice. Alexa, skip track. I'll turn the volume up for the next one. Check it out. Watch how loud this is. Alexa, skip track. Alexa, stop music. Alexa, home. So really convenient to play music. You can check out lyrics. You can sing along with it if you're into that karaoke scene. Uh, let's watch some videos now. So Alexa, Open YouTube. Here is YouTube. All right, so I've got YouTube open. There is another way of getting into this, but I just used my voice, which I just found so much easier. Man, that screen looks nice. So full HD display, scroll up and down, and that's giving you a real tablet-like experience. Put some thumbs on. We asked the questions. I'm just curious. I mean, what brought y'all into this? Long story. <laughs> Who are you? 
are you? I'm your new manager. There's a sensitive and awkward situation between you and you. In from the west, right? It was getting pretty bad out that way now. Folks turning on each other. <laughs> just want to show you if you swipe down from the top you can tap video and then it will bring up all the video apps that you have built in so we've got prime video netflix youtube um, you've got red bull tv and that is pretty much it now you can't install any apps on this you can't install third-party apps youtube looks like it's going to run from the web browser which it does indicate prime netflix and red bull look like they are apps but they are pre-installed for you um, you can open any of these apps with your voice you can just ask her to open netflix or open prime or you can even ask for a movie so for example alexa play reacher season one here's reacher season one episode one i'm sorry i'm not good at math you can pause the movie with your voice you can skip forward you can skip back over here you can see hd 1080p streaming so we are streaming amazon prime video full HD right now and it looks great on that screen so I've signed into Netflix you can uh, again with your voice choose what you like or you can scroll through just like a tablet or a phone and select exactly what you want to watch and as you can see Netflix HD is supported so I'm gonna briefly play something just to show you how this looks now what I like about the Echo Show 15 is the power and performance you're getting everything that I've done on this so far is so fast um, it simply flies whether you're going to the home page or whether you're loading up a movie anything you do on this is instant so if we go back to the video page you will see it just loads bang it doesn't take long now the echo show 15 is actually powered by an Amlogic octa core CPU um, so plenty of power and performance no matter what you're trying to watch or no matter what app you're trying to open it's going to open instantly so there you have it guys that was my very quick look at the brand new echo show 15 by amazon so it's like an all-in-one entertainment streaming hub slash tablet and bluetooth speaker all rolled into one nice looking frame so you can enjoy your music nice and loud the speakers are incredible you do have dual speakers sound quality is also pretty good so loud and proud really nice speakers i use my echo dot a lot i'm sure most of you guys do as well and i use it mainly for the weather and music um, but this new echo show 15 is going to be very useful seeing everything visually is a much much better experience i also have a few cameras linked to my alexa um, and ring and i like watching that on demand that's very useful and everything can be controlled with your voice i'm surprised to how good the screen quality is full hd crisp and sharp 1920 by 1080 videos netflix youtube everything looks really nice uh, on this i was actually going to call it a tablet on the echo show 15. so that was my two pence on the echo show 15. i hope this gave you an idea of what this thing can do let me know what you guys think have you already picked one up and you've been using it for a while let me know your thoughts it'd be nice to hear what you guys think of this one that's all for this video don't forget to like and subscribe thank you so much for watching and i hope you all have an amazing day see you guys in the next one Peace.